Oh, good morning. Uh, it's Monday the uh, 25th of May 2020. It's bank holiday Monday. And uh, up for a ride out. Not sure where to yet. So uh, stay tuned and we'll uh, see where we end up. Um, well, today would have been the day, about this time now, uh, we would have been uh, on the uh, Oliad to Dublin ferry, so we'd have been somewhere in the Irish Sea by now, as it's uh, about half past nine, somewhere in the Irish Sea, on our way to do the Wild Atlantic Way. So the plan was, last night we were going to, we'd booked in to stay overnight in Holyhead, for the Premier Inn, and then uh, very first thing, I think it was 8.15, uh, over to Dublin and then from Dublin to Ennis on the first night tonight would have been in Ennis and look at the weather look at the weather we'd have been having and uh, so I'm a bit sad really that that's not happening but at least uh, I'm getting a ride out and hence the reason I'm on the uh, Explorer today because I would have been going on the Explorer I realised last night it's seven months since this been out so they had it serviced in uh, October last year, it's annual service. And uh, I took it home, put it in the garage and I haven't used it since because uh, the ride outs of the early part of this year have been curtailed. So the ride outs that I have done, which are only uh, four I think, four, I've done on the Bobber or the uh, Thruxton R. So uh, nice to be out. Uh, enjoying the Explorer. I forgot how much I love this bike. I call it uh, the flying armchair. It's, it's, uh, it's really comfortable and uh, it's lots of fun. It's a bugger when he's standing still to manoeuvre around because I'm such a short ass. So it's a heavy big bike but when you're, when you're on it it's, uh, and it's moving it's a really uh, smooth and uh, enjoyable piece of kit, so I really like it. So, yeah, um, I was going to go yesterday, but I just couldn't be bothered. I don't know why, again, as I mentioned this in my last video about the fact that I was becoming sort of institutional, I was staying at home. and. Uh, had the chance to go yesterday and I, uh, I decided not to so I don't know what the hell's wrong with me but uh, with weather like this it would be rude not to you know, as I say I'm not quite sure where we're off to yet but uh, all will be revealed but again it is lovely to have these roads uh, pretty much to ourselves that's about the only positive thing I can think of about this bloody lockdown situation is that the roads are a lot less congested now this is a bank holiday Monday so there'll be uh, a fair old bit of traffic coming down here now probably on a normal uh, under a normal situation. So we'll make the most of it. Before normality returns. So she's just coming into Stourport now. Bank holiday starport would be absolutely packed to the rafters. Let's have a look what it looks like today. We would be queuing into here now. Ah, we're not going through the town. Going out towards Butelay.
Just stopped off for a full fly in Lemster. Now we're uh, having a steady ride back. So we're just having a chat, and uh, the weather looks like it's going to be nice next weekend, next Sunday. So uh, I think we might have a ride up to the Peak District. So. Uh, That'd be very nice if we do that. So uh, we'll keep that as an option. The weather's looking good for the hold of this week. So I uh, like the idea of doing that trip up to the Peak District. So unfortunately the YouTube channel suffering a little bit this year um, We've not been able to get many ride outs in, up to now So hopefully that will change Over the coming uh, weeks and months and we start to get a few more in And uh, believe it or not, I'm not having as much time in the evenings as I have to uh, edit them Because I'm actually spending my time in the garden at the moment, enjoying the uh, the nice weather and the fresh air and the um, and the work I've done to get the garden into shape. I'm having a bit less time to um, produce the videos, but uh, we have got one in process at the moment from uh, weekend before last. And then there'll be a couple of videos for today.
PMC Chrysler, I believe. Yeah, that thing had come and loose, come and loose, had to tighten it up. Yeah, all good mate. So we're on the uh, last leg of the journey home now. We're north of Troy, uh, which heading towards Kidderman Staff, which is the A442. It's been a lovely ride out. I think we all needed it. We all needed to feel a little bit of normality on the day we should have been uh, off to the land of the Guinness drinkers. And uh, I think it, uh, it's gone some little way towards uh, towards um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, I don't know. Towards us satisfying the craving to be out touring on our bikes. Should have some Insta360 footage to make a video with. Have me on the uh, on the Explorer. So I've got some on the bomber. Got some on the Thruxton. 
haven't got any on this bike yet. So that will probably be a video. All being well. If you haven't had any glitches of this bike in action. As I was saying a bit earlier, we're planning the uh, the Peak District at the weekend. Weather permitting. So, we get home, I suppose gardening's on the agenda this afternoon. Cut the lawns. Got some grass seeding to do. But uh, I probably won't be today. grass seed in to do and uh, maybe even a little fire tonight a little fire in the chimney I bought a smokeless um, fuel block from B&Q yesterday so I'm going to give that a little go Let's see what he does I'm on leave this week for the rest of the week so I don't know whether I'm going to be uh, out again in the day this week I may well be Five days stay through to Friday, then Saturday coming back from uh, from Ireland. I was really looking forward to doing that with uh, what I'd seen from videos on YouTube of uh, others that had done the uh, Wild Atlantic Way. I was really looking forward to doing it. Uh, it was only this big disappointment this year is not being able to do that. That's my biggest uh, disappointment I think for the year. But all things being equal, we'll do it next year. And we'll hopefully get a trip of some description in. A couple of days away. Maybe a little bit later in the year. That's uh, the uh, across that we can do that. By now we would have been in Ireland and would have been out of Dublin probably and heading over to uh, towards Ennis. We're going to cross country towards Ennis where the first part we're going to be. Oh. And this is the good thing about this point, when you're aching a bit you can stand up. Even that few seconds of standing up there has uh, loosened my legs up a little bit. I had forgotten how much I'd love this big old beast. Okay, that's blowing on up here. Well, this road's a favourite of. Uh, those who are still live just outside Birmingham, one of the uh, primary roads we use to get over towards um, Worcester. Always has been, even when I was a uh, teenager, when I first had motorbikes, this was a regular road. And it has been ever since, really. Uh, the road that uh, you're coming from Birmingham into Hagley you carry straight on the 4560 Kidderminster star and then you swing a left down here can't remember what the road number is that takes you down towards Harkerbury and Harvington Harvington Hall where I went um, as a school kid St Matthew's School day trip to Harvington Hall to see the priest hole and the big chimney that was uh, there on Harvington Hall that really brings back a, a school kid memory for me when I uh, when I see Harlington or think about Harlington. Big turkey left here you get down into Kidderminster. There it is, the side of Harlington Hall. I'm not going to wrap the video up for today. I never know when the, uh, when the battery's going to run out. So I'm going to wrap it up to that. And as always, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if 
you enjoyed it, please give us a like. Consider subscribing. It's not about the numbers, but it's nice to uh, be doing something that people get some enjoyment out of. So if you do like them, and, uh, you, know, you sort of want to be alerted to when I've done any more videos, just please hit the subscribe button. And, feed, and also feel free to leave a comment. Most welcome. Uh, comments and feedback. Very welcome indeed. So again, um, take care of yourselves and your family. Let's hope this is not uh, going to go on for very much longer. And I shall see you again very soon for another video.